Okay, I, uh, I, I still haven't mounted the body on the chassis, but what I have decided to do is to go ahead and put my uh, hood seal on. So what I did is I got the seal. It has these three little spiky things that go on each corner and then have this channel. And so I already did this top one and I found that the thing to do is to take WD-40 and spray it along the uh, Spray it along the uh, uh, this part here, which is the little nub channel, and then I just kind of let that uh, go down there, and then uh, same on this one, just to make sure there's WD-40 right by the little rounded part, and then in here, what I've found, if some paint gets in there. Since it's just going to be pulled along in here, uh, I, I I found that this um, little a paint opener works great. This is a paint can opener, and since it has the little hooked end, what you can do is just make sure that there's no piece of the old rubber or uh, anything blocking. See, like here, uh, you wouldn't be able to feed that through. Uh, if you if you're blocking that and you might scratch a little bit uh, but You have to have a clear channel otherwise pulling that rubber through, even if it has WD-40 on it It'll never make it so like for example here anywhere where this hangs up you Pull that through Get down here I'll just uh, go around the whole thing. See, like here, there's no way, no way that would have gotten through here. Yeah, this is painted. So let's check this here. All looks good. See, look at that little spot there. See, it would never get through there. Kill that with the with this. That looks pretty good. Also, if you have to bend a little part up like there. So I just have to fix this one little part down here, which seems like it's either painted. Yeah, this right here this is not going to hold anything unless I do something. It needs to, it needs to have a channel behind so that the rounded part can fit in there. And I think that because this is the end and this it's like it was a little rusted. Let's go over it. I just need this channel to be clear. See? You can get a piece like that out. I would have prevented it from going through. So I think I have this whole thing pretty good now. And now I'm going to try to. Uh, I'll just start that off with a little bit of WD 40. Set, set this here and see if I can actually. Pull this through. So starting with the end here, feed this through.
take a look here. So this now has these three things that have to be pulled through. I'm just gonna spray a, to have a WD-40 on each of these. I have to wipe this off later. And now I have my, I have a uh, needle nose pliers here. Let's see if I can actually get at these things. First one. Hey, Josh. I'm pretty good. All right, so what I've got here, I pulled these little guys through here. With these um, three thingies on each. And then this comes down here all the way to the end. And I've got these guys here. So, my understanding in this is that at the end, I need to cut. I'm gonna cut this one a little bit too long, but I'll cut it. And then this one, I'll cut this one around here. My understanding is that you want it to be a little V so that it can drain. Um, but uh, as far as the actual length of this, to this one around comes more or less to the middle. This one here can be cut. This one here. And a little more than that. And here, this one just probably is okay, right? Just like that. Let me tuck that in with a little screwdriver and let's see how that looks. That is tucked in, and it looks like this. Uh, right at the bottom center, you know, there's like a little split. I think that's fine, I'm just gonna leave it like that. But then uh, I've cleaned off the majority of the of this. Okay, the next thing I've decided I'm gonna put in this um, trunk latch. Uh, cable so that goes into this hole here feed this all the way through let's see if this is painted shut why it's not coming through yeah I just have to push it harder So that came through and then I can put on, so I, I have a black, the thing that I painted black here, this piece here, this goes like, yeah, I must go on the inside here. So just like that. All right, let's just take a look. So this must go basically like this. So this little cover is how you let's see. This little cover.
All right, so this roughly goes like this. Um, I put the screw facing down. Question is, is will that be? This is gonna basically go in here like this. So if I put that facing down, the question is, is does that get in the way? And I think that's fine, actually. So I think that looks good. I did not gloss that up with any clear coat. It just has the uh, rust reformer on it, so it's not shiny, but I think it's okay. Oh, I still have some WD-40 on here from bringing this thing on. So. So, okay, one step at a time. 